Steel is a material the modern world has been built on. It is a basic material in the construction industry, and its quality determines the durability of any construction. How is the best steel made? The first stage is the production of pig iron in a blast furnace. The input material is sinter, i.e. iron ore, to which, among other things, low silica ores, fluxes, pollution-removing substances, and a special type of coke, referred to as breeze, are added. These components are measured in appropriate proportions in the burdening shop of a sintering plant, and then fed on a sintering belt where sinter is produced. Sinter and coke are basic input materials for a blast furnace. The charge is poured into the furnace from the top. At the bottom, nozzle sets blow air into the furnace at the temperature of about 1000 degrees C. This is called a hot blow. At ArcelorMittal steel plant in Dobrova Gornica, each furnace is equipped with 32 nozzle sets. In one day, 12 pig iron tappings are performed here. Each tapping, which lasts about 80 minutes, produces about 300 to 500 tons of pig iron. Pig iron is transported from the furnace to the steelworks in huge torpedo vats, each holding up to 400 tons. In the steelworks, pig iron undergoes the process of desulfurization and purification with oxygen in a converter, a blast furnace that can reach the temperature of 1,700 degrees C, where scrap metal is also placed. The converter produces liquid steel that is further sent to a continuous casting line, wherein it is processed into slabs or billets. In this form, as a semi-finished product, steel can already be delivered to the customer. Most often, however, it still undergoes the rolling process. The steel charge is heated in the furnace to 1,250 degrees C, then shaped between turning rolls and finally cooled by a stream of water. This process is called pot rolling. This is how the finished steel coils are made, but some applications require further processing. The first process is etching, i.e. removal of iron oxide by means of hydrochloric acid. Another process is cold rolling without heating the charge in the furnace. Afterwards, the material is sent to a galvanizing plant or annealed at the temperature of about 700 degrees C. The last stage is coating. Sheets used in the production of roofing are coated with three coats. A passivating coat containing titanium, a primer, and finally a decorative coat. Sheet metal in this form is packed and transported to Black Profil 2, where it is processed into finished products for roofing or facade cladding that shall be sent to our customers.